We're the local KSIH dealers at Westwall and Forbes in Brentford. And we have sold and serviced the combine behind me here. And we've also sold an uh, onboard protein analyzer to uh, a competitor's machine so they can be fitted to any machine. My name's Broden Holland. We're at our family farm, Kulpari Enterprises. We farm four and a half thousand hectares. We comprise of 50-50 wheat and canola split with a pasture phase. We purchased the grain analyzer this year with our new 7240, which is behind me. We purchased it just because we want to find out our variations in nitrogen and our limitations of certain areas of each paddock. So we've used it in wheat, canola and barley and it's been quite accurate across all those. To change from crop type it's literally a two minute job, you just got to change a couple of spaces and away you go. In the paddock that we're in today of the 200 hectares that it comprises of, 40 hectares of that was low protein, 10%, the rest of it was doing about 12%. So we were able to blend that area with the rest of the field to get that up to a higher protein, so in turn we got three extra loads to the silos, which was $30 a tonne more. Next year going forward, it's going to be really easy. We're going to be able to get our protein maps, overlay them with our yield maps, and we're going to be able to work out where our low areas of our farm, where our high areas are, and we're going to be able to increase our inputs in our areas that need more, and decrease our inputs in our areas that don't need as much attention. So we're going to go completely variable rate with our urea, lime, gypsum, everything. We're also going to use soil sampling, the protein and the yield maps and put them all together. And the protein is going to be the biggest thing for our nitrogen because it's, it's a clear indicator of nitrogen extraction, nitrogen removal. And we're going to exactly see what parts of the paddocks are doing low and what parts of the paddocks are high. So if a paddock like today was doing H2 in one area and APW in another, and we're then able to work out whether we can blend that area or we just treat it as a different area. And that way we don't get contamination and bring all the paddock down. We can, we can just work out the low area. The moisture meter in the header, it, it enables us not to have to get out of the machine. And it also gives us a wide range of tests across the whole paddock and not just where we test it with a handheld meter outside. The screen, which has got really big buttons, so you can either get a USB or over the internet. I've just been getting my phone, just a USB cable, plug my phone into it, download the data. I can do it then and there and go and put it on my laptop. It's really easy to use. It's well laid out. Everything's there, ready to go. It's been maintenance free. You should clean it every day, but sometimes you can't just because of harvest time. And on the odd day, I haven't cleaned it for three days and I open it up on the third day and it's, it's still spotless. We love that it's an Australian product. The service from KSIH, it's local. The machine's built here, so we're able to get parts straight away for it if anything goes wrong. We're just wrapped with the service that we've been able to get with the machine and, and the analyzer. KSIH have uh, been behind this product for a long time. It's Australian made which is wonderful, and it's a product that will eventually go on all headers, you know, once they see the financial benefit of it.